All right, and then this story just popped up about 10 minutes right before we were going live. I have not read it, but let's see what it's all about here. So not great, but here it is. Aaron Darnold is facing assault charges after allegedly attacking a man in Pittsburgh. Ooh, not great. Who's picking a fight with Aaron Donald? Oh, my goodness. You're, you're, you're out of your gourd if you do that. But let's see what's going on. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This man's eye is swollen shut. He got hit so hard by Aaron Donald. God damn. Oh, Aaron Donald, not good out here. Let's see if he had, if he was justified. But this picture alone, God damn, that man got beat up. <laughs> that man got God out there. Aaron Donald. I mean, yeah, first of all, why are you picking a fight with Aaron Donald? Like we just said, I mean, the man's like two-time back-to-back defensive player of the year in the NFL. Why are you pick? You can pick a fight with anybody else on this planet, but you chose Aaron Donald. Hmm. This man's out of his gourd over here. All right, but let's see who accused. Well, let's just see what this fight is going on about. All right, here we go. Aaron Donald might be in some serious legal trouble. Lawyer Todd Hollins. I mean, we got to keep track of all these lawyers' names. Uh, Busby and Rusty Harden. I mean, that doesn't even sound like a name, Rusty Harden. You chose a, a, a attorney that's name is Rusty Harden, Deshaun Watson? That's not the greatest. Uh, uh, so now we got to freaking remember Todd Hollins. Another lawyer out here. All right. Lawyer Todd Hollins told KDA that he is filing an assault charge against the Los Angeles Rams superstar defensive player on behalf of his client, Day Vincent Springs. Day Vincent Springs. Yeah, he got beat up. God damn. He got beat up, man. His eye is literally swollen shut, folks. It's swollen shut. Big old swollen eye. Black and blue. I don't know what this is. I don't know if this is his normal skin, but... It doesn't help the cause. <laughs> it doesn't help the cause. Uh, all right, let's see what uh, what is going on. What what happened with this altercation? The 29-year-old Darnold is considered the best defensive player in football. Who took? Yeah, we get this. What what happened here? Okay, I don't care about. We all know who Aaron Donald is. I want to know why he fought this man. We don't get any information here. Allegedly, for allegedly attacking the Vincent Springs over the weekend in Pittsburgh. Okay, but why? Why? How are you not putting the why in the article? Who started it? Did he punch Aaron Donald first and Aaron Donald would just punch back? We're literally getting no information here. Attorney Todd Hollins provided a picture to KDA uh, Andy Shaheen of a man who appeared to have a swollen eye and cuts on his face and said he would be pressing charges. Hollins... Hollis says, Day Vincent Springs, who is the main, who is the man in the photo, intends to file criminal charges for an alleged assault in an overnight hours in the overnight hours of last weekend. So this got done late at night. All right, not great. It allegedly happened between three and four in the morning at an after hours club on the city south side. So maybe some drinks were involved. Some drunken Aaron Donald throwing punches out here. Uh, just before the noon hour, Hollins and Springs, 26, arrived in the Pittsburgh police station and filed it. Hollins said Darnold, Donald allegedly beat Springs. Springs. Oh, my God. I'm getting all these names wrong. I'm, I apologize, folks. Um, Hollins said Donald allegedly beat Springs, who was later treated and released at a local hospital. He is asking the police here to conduct a full investigation. Hollins identified Spriggs as an out-of-towner, but declined to say from where. The man's an out-of-towner. All right. Spriggs, who has his arm in a sling. Oh, he's got, he's got his arm in a sling. We didn't see that in the picture. We just saw the big old eye. <laughs> the big old swollen eye. So arm in a sling, big old puffed up uh, upright eye, invisible stitches, and had little to say. Were you assaulted, sir? Yes, I was. Was this unprovoked? It was definitely unprovoked. I've instructed him not to make any comments, but as you can see from this arm in a sling, his eye is closed. 16 stitches, damn, 16 stitches in his eye and, his, and a concussion and other severe injuries he suffered. This is a severe incident. So Hollis has instructed Spriggs to not make any comments at this time. Donald, 29, was named Defensive Player of the Year. Yeah, why did we keep saying? We all know Aaron Donald, damn. Um, he played at the university. Oh, my God. Why? Uh, I want to know more about the crime. I don't care about this man's resume of him playing in Pittsburgh and being Defensive Player of the Year. I want to know about the in altercation. We all know Aaron Donald. 
Um, alrighty, so we really don't, it just happened at a club between 3 and 4 in the morning, the man's got stitches, big old puffed up eye, arm in a sling, he said he was unprovoked, but I mean, that's what everybody says, right? Yeah, it was unprovoked. Those massage therapists are also saying that they were unprovoked of, you know, jerking off Deshaun Watson while giving him a massage, so we'll see what happens with Aaron Donald now, not great here for these superstars in the NFL.